symbol. It's the recognition that you are identifying with the death and resurrection of Jesus. And so when we do this, like Lucy here was getting baptized, it was always a public thing so that the whole church could celebrate. So when she comes out of that water, I need you guys to cheer like somebody won the Super Bowl. Okay? okay? Super Bowl is nothing compared to, to what she's doing. Amen. So um, I think we have everybody coming. So if you don't mind, Miss Lucy, will you get in the water? It is warm. Check that out. We will be quick, I promise. So come over here. Right here. Now, now have a seat. Now look, I need you to face this way though. Look at this wall for me. Uh huh. Now. Yeah, see, this is nice. Now hold your nose. <laughs> hold your nose for right now. Well, let go of your nose for a second so you don't have to talk. I'm going to ask you a question. Have you made Jesus Christ the Lord and Savior of your life? So based on your profession of faith, Lucy, I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. So if you'll hold your nose. <laughs> Josh, have you made Jesus Christ the Lord and Savior of your life? So based on your profession of faith, I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Jesus Christ, Lord and Savior of your life. So based upon your public profession of faith, I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit.